Okay, Moon Pie is back during the day. Was under all the bird feeders eating. Been here quite some time. Still moving slow, but looking good otherwise. Curious how old this guy is. He is big. He is such a big skunk. His head is gigantic and those jaws are so powerful. Just beautiful. And uh, this is pretty close for me being with Moon Pie. Cruella lets me get right next to her. But uh, if he looks like he's going to squirt, I'm hiding behind this tree right here. <laughs> this is my defense. He's not 100% the way he's walking, so I don't want to try and push it and get too close. But I'm going to keep feeding him. I do have dog food out here too, and I'm curious if he smelt that and found that yet. But for now, he's had it rough. He needs some cookies. Right, Moon Pie? Aw, I want you to get better. Oh, look how hungry Moon Pie is. So it's in that same spot, I mean, exact spot, is where uh, I taped him and Cruella mating, which was uh, pretty exciting. He was a very excited boy, and he would run off, and he'd come back for seconds, and he came back for thirds. And when he would bolt off, he just was like Speedy Gonzalez how fast. I've never seen a skunk move as fast as he did. Very different now. Now he's moving really slow. Now his eyes look kind of funny. But then again, I'm not used to seeing skunks during the day. I don't know what their eyes should look, look, look like. They almost look bluish. Are they kind of glazed over? Does he have glaucoma? Well, maybe it's normal. So it looks like, uh, is his front paw kind of curled like that? I think this guy has it pretty rough. Look how hungry he is. Oh, moon pie. There you go, buddy. Have yourself a nice treat. I'll get some dog food out here for you, too. I don't think he found my piles. Boy, look at the head on him. It's just gigantic. Well, I am as close as I've ever been to Moon Pie. He's about uh, three feet in front of me. And I think this is where I'm going to try and back off real slow. Just because I'm not as familiar with Moon Pie as I am with Cruella. But he wants to keep getting close to me. He hears me. He sees me if his eyes are working right. He is a impressive looking skunk, I have to say. But uh, someone told me they don't have to be with the tail at you to squirt you. They kind of flip their tail right over and give you a squirt and I'm just curious if he would do that with me. And I really don't want to get it. And I know a lot of you out there say don't worry about it, they're not going to do it. But I've been smelling it night after night. So they're squirting the raccoons. And you've also told me that it takes them 10 days to refill their reservoirs. Why am I smelling it every night? So I think I have some extra special skunks here, which has me a little concerned because they seem to have uh, the ability to squirt night after night. Right, Moon Pie? Do you got the stinky juice on you? I smelt it strong last night. I don't know, should I say Happy Oons Day or Happy Unks Day? I might have to change my channel, I'm getting all this skunk action lately. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, you can back up, that's okay. I think I'm going to back up too. Nice and slow like. Bye bye Moon Pie. 
Okay, so Mama Moira's here, and right behind Moira is a deer who uh, just heard me. That's right, deer. I'm outside and I'm talking. <laughs> my backyard is a zoo. Oh my goodness, there's another deer right there. Who's here? Hi there, pal. I was feeding moon pie. How do you like that, Mr. Wiener? The male skunk's letting me feed him, kinda. Not out of the hand. I'm not so sure about that yet, but we're gonna get there. Oh, buddy, did you have fun last night opening envelopes? Yeah, you did. You were so silly. Oh, that's what you really want. You want the cookie. Okay, go dunk it in the water. Yeah, a bunch of them are showing up now. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And there's a couple that way. Hard to tell it's dark. So they're just starting to come in. It's going to turn out to be another Happy Oons Day and Unks Day. Hi. You want to come on up? You want to come sit on my lap? Come on up here. It's okay. Come on up here. Come sit on my lap. I like it when you sit on my lap. You're such a cute boy. There you go. There you go. Look at that big butt. So do you know I'm hiding them in my pocket? You're going to figure that out, right? They're not in my hand. They're right here. Smell in my pocket? There's the thief. There's the thief I know. Yeah. Yeah, you just hang out here. Oh, don't fall. Oh, there you go. What are you looking for? You going to be a thief too? Here they come. And I smell skunk again. Unless it's on me. That's possible. <laughs> oh, you have to work so hard for your food, Mr. Wiener. Oh my goodness, look how tall you are. You're way up there in the world now, buddy. <laughs> I love that kid. Kid, he's gonna, he's probably getting close to two years old. I'm guessing these guys are probably born in April or May, and then the moms start bringing them in early June. Uh, this year might be a little earlier because we had such a warm winter, and I'm trying to pay attention to the females. I'm definitely noticing a difference in their attitude for sure, um, but I'm trying to see if I see a belly growing on any of them or if I see uh, swollen teats at all. Did you mate with anyone, Mr. Wiener? I really want to know. Because I would love to see your offspring. I want more of your genetics in my backyard for sure. Just hang out up here. Just let me give you a horsey ride on my knee. Hi, Grizzy. How you doing, big boy? I'm guessing uh, your genes got spread around. <laughs> You're a big guy. Oh, boy, he's back for more. Careful with Grizz. Yeah. What do you smell? Do you smell that skunk? I smell it too. Who is it? Is it Cruella or Moon Pie stinking up this backyard? You're getting my sweatshirt all wet. This is my way to get my pets in. I gotta trick you up here. Yeah, you just hang out up here. I need a water bowl up here so you don't have to go. Are you gonna take out another one? You being greedy? Are you gonna find the mother load? You want a horsey back ride on my leg? Sit down. I'll give you a horsey back ride. What, did you change your mind on your cookie? You're unsure about this one, I know. I don't blame you. What are you looking for? You're not sure? I think this one wants peanuts. There we go. Peanuts it is. You gonna do this again? You're getting me so wet, Mr. Wiener. My leg is sopping wet because of you. You have to take a shower. Oh, you're so silly. Oh, you're so silly. Look at you tug on my sweatshirt. Oh, you gotta love a raccoon like that. 
it makes uh, hand feeding so much fun when they're so good, so well behaved. So no little Napoleon yet. He's someone, if he climbed up my leg, I'd be going, oh boy, where's this going to head? Because he's, uh, he's kind of nippy. <laughs> I don't know how to fix that. He had this one day where he was taking it so gentle from my hand, and I don't know what happened. Maybe he uh, didn't feel the need to compete with the others around him. But uh, that's done. Ever since I went up to his squirrel house there and uh, tinkered around with it, he's, he's got a grudge with me now. I was just trying to help too. Wiener, I still don't know where you live. I have no idea what your address is. I probably found one of the trees. Uh oh, it's empty. It's empty. You're going to have to dig in there for it. There you go. Nope, nope. I'm going to put it back in the pocket. It's going back in. How'd that happen? Say what? Where did it go? What kind of magic trick is this? I reached in there and there was nothing and now there's a cookie. What? <laughs> It's shaky, Mr. Wiener. Careful. There you go, you big chunker. <laughs> Look how he tries to walk with it. Just carry it with your mouth. Why you gotta make it difficult? So here's Tiny Tim. Uh, there's Cleopatra. There's Grizz. There's a dark one. That is not Midnight and that is not Ebony. I have no name for that one. Some coming down the sidewalk here. Got a good group showing up. So you see how wet I am here. We played that uh, envelope game last night where they had to open up envelopes. That was Mr. Wiener's secret. He would come with sopping wet hands and get that envelope all wet. And then he could tear it open real fast. Tiny Tim was having a tough time because his hands were dry. Okay, buddy. Here's the thing. My pockets are empty. What are you going to do? Looky here. Looky here. Here's the mother load. See that? That's where it's at. Uh oh, how are you going to get that? Yeah, just crawl all over me. Oh, now you found it. Now you're in raccoon heaven. Oh, yeah. Now you got it good. You goofball. You silly, silly boy. <laughs> That's a tough reach, huh? And tickle your armpit. Okay. Now you gotta make it through the crowd. There he goes. Okay, guys. Does anyone want marshmallows? There's some dessert before I go in. Everyone be good. <laughs> All right, happy Oons Day, guys. You got to see some uh, cool skunk action tonight with Moon Pie. And uh, some nice uh, deer in the yard, some raccoons. All in all, it's a pretty good day. Good night.